Yeah, well, I don't think he should be sacked. Uh, yeah, I'm a Gordon Strachan fan. I, d I do think that he's the man for the job at the moment. Uh, look at the alternatives. They're, un they're not sticking out like sore thumbs, I can tell you that. And uh, you say to yourself, who could get more out of... Now, the best manager on the planet is Sir Alec Ferguson. And I worked with him. It was privileged, and Ruffy was there. Uh, we were there in, in Mexico. Now, he's the best you could get. Now, I, I wonder if Sir Alec could do better with that team. That, with, it's the, I think it's the quality of players that Gordon has. You know, there are very few other... I mean, I was over and I was privileged to be invited as a guest by one of the sponsors and travelled with the squad over to Slovakia. Now, everything they did, in my opinion, was right. You know, I even watched the training and I, it was a bit embarrassing. We were invited to watch the training. I didn't like to think that Gordon Hink was spying on him or something yeah. because, you know, I'm a strong supporter, but... You know, you couldn't fault anything that happened in the trip over there. So you're saying, where's the problem? And I'm sure tactically the players all say it, and tactically he's proved that he's capable in that regard. It's the fact that the players are not good enough, and I keep repeating that, and it's maybe an easy excuse. And I'm sitting here as a former manager. Now, the easiest team to coach is somebody else's team. Yeah. I mean, you're always, you know, look at that, marking at that corner, look at that throw and it's no practice. You know, you could sit and say that, but it's very difficult to say that against any of Gordon's teams.